What, what, what's, what's this about? This is about you, Nitwit. Michael Williams Leon. You got a list of prior arrest dating back 10 years, but who's counting? I, I, didn't, I didn't do nothing. Not today, but you did a bullet on Rikers a couple of years ago. And that's the good news. You want to hear the bad news? You ain't been to see a P.O. in two months. Now you know what that means, don't you? He misses me? Move it! All you gotta do is call him, all right? I was going to see him. Look, don't I at least get a phone call? I got something better. Hey, Williams! Come here! I got someone here I want you to meet. Fuck you, your mother's a kind of ball. Hey, you skinny bitch, nothing but a fucking drunk. Can you guys share a fucking dick? Shut up, you drunk. Telling you shit. I ain't no fucking barfly either. Oh, fuck you. Take it easy, will you? No. Detective Martinez is Detective Metaboy. Cops, thank God. You finally figured out Archie's in real danger. So Archie's living here with you? You don't know how many sleepless nights we've had. Well, time the authorities finally stepped in. Where is he now, Yvette? He'll be back any minute. He'll be so relieved yeah. finally getting some protection. Yvette, what's going on? It's okay, they're cops. Listen, I'm a mark man, okay? Did she tell you what's going on? Of course I told them. Why don't we talk about this down at our station? No, no, no way. I'm not going anywhere. Could, could someone go up on the roof and check for snipers? I think there's a sniper up there. Please. Why don't you come with us? We'll guarantee a safe trip. How about a guarantee for my safety? Right. No, I'm not going anywhere. I'm not leaving your vet here unprotected, okay? Your vet can go with us. I'm putting on my sunglasses and my scarf. That was ten years ago, and that cat wanted to die. <laughs> it threw itself in front of my cock because people were asking it too many questions. <laughs> no, you're funny. You're just a funny person. I'm funny how? Funny like a clown, huh? Like I amuse you, huh? I'm here for your freaking amusement, huh? <laughs> no, no, you, you're just you're oh, funny. You, you, you didn't see Goodfellas, did you? I meant to. <laughs> okay. So, uh, you like to read, or uh, do you just knock your patients out with those things? <laughs> no, I read them. I like to read. Actually, right now I'm reading something by James Joyce. You've ever heard of him? Uh, yeah, a little. I love this short story called The Dead. Have you ever heard of it? Are you kidding? That is my favorite short story. Get out, it is! <laughs> yeah. <laughs> show off then like in Ulysses you yeah know? I tried reading that what's the matter that guy couldn't spring for a few periods in common <laughs> and I think I figured out why they call it the dead really why I think it's about um, people that are dead even when they're alive because uh, because they're so trapped inside themselves Wow, oh, yeah that's good yeah you think I mean, I mean cuz I don't really know anything about anything you think it's good my wife's cheating on me good for her <laughs> I love you. You do? I do. I love you. Well, I really love you too, Ma. No matter how old you get, you'll always be my baby. Can I just wheel you over to my therapist for one second? She really needs to hear this. <laughs> Come here, sweetie. Okay. You are so sweet. I just wish... What? What is it, Ma? Keep talking. I'm loving this. <laughs> I just wish that I had breastfed you and Jimmy. <laughs> Jeez, Ma. I mean, God gave me breasts for a reason, so that I could suckle my young. Oh, Ma, please don't say suckle again, please. Suckle. <laughs> I said don't. 
Sparkle. Oh, yeah, that's better. The extra P made all the difference. Sparkle. <laughs> See, now that's worse. <laughs>